Hey, you guys want to go grab some food? <laughs> this this is going to be interesting. I will be honest with you. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about how you got started in Longhorn. Well, um, we went to the cherry blossom sale with some of our friends. The you know right before we started, and uh, they were interested in buying some animals. We were not at the time because we had dairy cows. And when we got down there and seen the Longhorns, I said to my wife, I said, uh, what do you think about getting involved in these? And she's like, what the heck do you want with these things? <laughs> <laughs> so <Screw> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, that year we did not buy. That was in 06, right? Okay. 07. Our friends wanted to buy a Longhorn Bull, so we went back to the Cherry Blossom with us, with them, and we ended up buying three cows, and that's how we started in it. Do you still have your first three? No, they are no longer there. If, if somebody was to go to your website, what, what would be your favorite animal they could look at, or the one that you're most proud of? Um, Creamsicle is probably my favorite uh, female. Um, even though I have a bunch of other ones, um, but she's been the one that been doing real good at the shows with us because we're real big in the show and we go cross country show and um, she uh, won us two world championships right in a row, so we were proud to you know have that and uh, she just had an awesome looking hammer camp. Yes, out of a out of a bull that we had uh, born and raised at our place, and we had sold him to uh, Joe Celeste, which his name was Nell Tam Sniper, and uh, so we ended up getting some semen out of that bull and, and uh, breeding our cows with him now. That uh, we just got a fancy yellow and white heifer out of cream sickle that will uh, I'm sure will follow in her foot footsteps that we are proud of. So what other bulls are you using right now? Uh, other bulls that we are using right now um, is Happy, which is our main herd sire that has did some wonderful things for us as far as producing some nice heifers. Um, another bull that we are using, we are in partnership with Jay Walker and Rob Fenzel, and his name is Destination Up. Um, we are using 20 gauge, which we are real proud of. Our, uh, his all spring are dropping on the ground this year for us. You just had a flashy heifer, right? Yes, a real flashy 20 gauge heifer right now out of him. Uh, Sniper, we are using Remounts Edge from Dick Lowe's program that uh, we got a fancy heifer off of him right now that we're proud of. We, uh, what else are we using? Was that, that wasn't six of them. Oh, JR Flash. We have some bred to JR Flash, which is uh, out of Tom and Shannon Miller's program. We're excited about him. We needed to, uh, we felt we needed to get some height on our happy bull heifers, so that's why we're using some of these bigger bulls to try and up, up you know, get a little more leg under them. And uh, that's, that's about, you know, it on the bulls that I could think of right now that I'm using. So who are some of your favorite animals just industry-wide, not necessarily ones that you've bred? Industry-wise mm -hmm. would be uh, on the bulls are the bulls that I mentioned are some of my favorite bulls right now that I think are going to be really hot bulls coming down the road here. What about females? Uh, females, I like the the uh, working woman cow she has produced a lot of offspring um that we have some of her you know breeding in our program um 
Another female would be uh, uh, let's see here. Now you got me thinking. <laughs> it's hard to pick sometimes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we can always come back to that one. Yeah, I have to. I have to think on some of them. So it's more than just you and Tammy that are really involved with the long friends, though, right? Yes, we got our granddaughter, which is involved in that uh, starting her own little herd that we, uh, some of them she owned herself, some of them were partnership on. And what's it called? What's her? Uh, her her uh, <coughs> is uh, a and Longhorns, is her uh, little ranch name. Adriana. And her name is Adriana Norris. <coughs> she uh, helps us show the animals. She helps us work all our animals. And uh, really getting fun. involved in going to the events with us. And then your brother comes along. And today. then my brother is also involved. Uh, <coughs> owns some cows of his own. His his, uh, his uh, Steve Hearn, Rising Dream Longhorns, and we are also partners on some animals. So, what do you and Tammy and your family do outside of the Longhorns? Outside of Longhorns, I do excavating, which is uh, a lot of commercial work or road work, run dozer, heavy equipment. And I'm a full-time bank teller. So, when you guys were at that first fraternity, um, where you really got got into it heavily, what was some of the best advice that you were given from folks? A lot of advice that I'll never forget, or one of the main things was, was, um, not to buy quantity, buy quality. You know, invest your money into good animals right away that, you know, want to uh, make you help pay, you know, make you an investment and help pay, you know, back. I don't what would be some of the best advice that you feel you could give to new breeders? Again, like what I was told from old timers, buy, buy quality, don't buy quantity. Um, read your pedigrees, learn your pedigrees. Um, know what you want to get in, you know, know what you want to get into as far as breeding a complete animal. Um, it's fun to explore and, and play with different bulls too and see don't just focus on one bull because one bull might not click with that cow but another bull might uh, that's what I'm enjoying um, as far as that's why I, I I went to AI classes and learn learn how to AI breed my own cows so that way I can play with different bulls and that's what we're doing to see what clicks with our females as far as you know what he, you know what they're gonna do we don't just you know I'm not just using my main herd sire or my junior herd sire we're mixing it up and seeing what clicks where to make us happy one more question do you guys know what you want to eat do we know what we want to eat <laughs> <Over there. laughs> a longhorn burger <laughs>